Now, a national conservation body has stepped in to try to help to save what's left of a piece of railway history. The Edge Hill station in Liverpool and Manchester's Liverpool Road station were the world's first passenger railway stations at either end of the Liverpool-Manchester railway. But as our transport correspondent Judy Hobson has been finding out, the original Edge Hill station is in urgent need of some TLC. In a remote and neglected area of southeast Liverpool lies one of the most important sites in the history of rail travel. For 40 years, campaigners have fought for Edge Hill Engine Station to have national recognition, and it's finally happened. Even though this is silent now, it was a place where something momentous happened in the history of the world, because now steam power had arrived, and from here on you can travel with steam power pulling you and not a horse. The station opened in 1830 and was the starting place of the world's first inter-urban locomotive hauled railway. Got the steps here the on the left. There, yep. Unfortunately now they're covered in vegetation but the steps are still there. Uh, we have... Paintings from the time show the station in all its former glory. For safety reasons, the locomotives weren't allowed in urban areas, so passengers initially entered carriages pulled up to the site by ropes. That little tunnel there was where passengers boarded at the other side of that tunnel. It's about uh, 300 metres long, and the coaches that they used were allowed to roll, this is on a gradient, roll to here, and then a steam locomotive came along coupled up and off they went to Manchester, 31 miles. This is now a scheduled monument and is protected. Campaigners hope the area will now be cleaned up and have proper access, hopefully in time for its 200th anniversary. At the moment there's no public access at all, but hopefully over the next eight years um, uh, arrangements can be made to uh, allow people to uh, to visit this really really quite remarkable site that hopefully Liverpool will will make the most of uh, with railway enthusiasts flocking to Liverpool and Manchester from around the world. Now that it's been given monument status it's really important for us to work with our local um, heritage groups to bring back I think how it used to be in its former glory. This was a pivotal moment in history and now protected for future generations. This is just one of those times in the history of the world when mechanical power took over from horses. And here we have a unique site that you can't find anywhere else in the world. Judy Hobson, BBC Northwest Tonight, Edge Hill. Uh, we'll continue to follow that story, of course, and let you know how uh, things develop in the months and years ahead.